Our next song is a story song. It's quite amusing. It's about a little character, a little puffin, the bird of puffin, uh, who is the shape of a muffin, as you read on the board. And this little puffin hasn't got his social life organised because the only people he can play with in the sea are the fishes and he keeps eating them. So you can imagine he's a rather lonely, sad little bird and then he gets to the point that actually if he stops eating all the people in the sea, he might actually have someone to play with. I want you to listen to the song. It's charming, it's amusing, it's light and then we're going to do some kind of hand jive to get this introduced to you. So have a listen to the Puffin song. wonderful little birds, aren't they? But the idea of them eating pancakes is a bit kind of uh, odd. Now this little song uses hand jive. When your grandparents were around, hand jive was really popular when rock and roll came in. Exactly. And if you hadn't got a partner, you could do hand jive all by yourself. So we're going to practice the hand jive moves and work with each section of the song. Up you get, guys. Now the first one is the slice. I'm going to start it off Join in with me, and don't worry if your left hand is where my right hand is, it doesn't matter at all. Here's the slice. Okay, really give it a bit of attitude, a bit of welly here. Puffins and wellies, really good. Fantastic, so that's the slice. Now the second one, my colleague there already knows, but you take your index finger and point it at the other elbow, okay? And this finger becomes a windmill, okay? The hard bit is when we change over. Okay, and change back again. That's wonderful. Now at that point in the song, the music changes its feel and it goes into a kind of three. And we're going to change our hand up and we're going to do drumming fists and we're going to go quite slow. That's brilliant, absolutely.